Hi, and welcome to another training demo from learningcomputer.com. Our website specializes in free IT training and distance learning. We have uh, quite a few topics in here, so feel free to check it out. Uh, today, what I'm going to do is basically uh, be focusing in on video marketing and showing you uh, three different websites that you can use to upload your videos. Um, I'm going to uh, go a little bit faster because I'm trying to keep this under 10 minutes. So obviously the first website is YouTube, uh, which is the number one player uh, in online uh, video uh, and whatnot. And if you have not signed up, you can sign up for a free account. I'm already logged in. So once you're in your account, uh, you can uh, you know look up your videos. You can go check out your account profile and whatnot. I'm going to uh, just simply uh, going to upload a video so for that you can click on this uh, yellow button and uh, it will take you to this page then I will uh, click on upload and, and I'm already in the right uh, place for my file but if you're not you will have to uh, essentially browse to the correct location and uh, I'm going to select the file which is uh, essentially a file uh, a video on search engine ranking and optimization uh, I will do that and now while uh, this is uh, uploading to the site, I'm actually going to switch to Word. And uh, I've already put this th together, but basically you need three things for uh, these websites. You need a title, uh, talking about your video. You need a little bit of description, uh, you know, maybe two, three sentences describing what it's all about. And then uh, the most important is keywords, which is essentially the, the words and expressions that people will use to find your video. So the first one is search engine ranking and optimization I'm going to simply copy this and come over here and put this in the title okay and actually I'm going to uh, do this uh, sample essentially because this is not uh, the actual file but uh, nevertheless I'm going to go ahead and copy my text from description and notice that in what in, in this what we have done is uh, I'm actually going to change this this is one of our other websites I have placed my uh, essentially website right at the top and what that does is when somebody's watching the video you know if they want to know more about the video or if they would like to know about your services they can simply click on that and typically what I'll do is I'll uh, leave some space in there and as for his description I will say this that uh, I don't exactly know what the total number of text characters you can put in there but I have uh, been able to upload as much as up to 800 characters uh, in here so you know definitely feel free to put in a lot of this information because not only uh, you know the information from the tags is used but also from description so right now I only have three sentences but I would encourage uh, you to add some more uh, if you can okay now while this is going on I'm going to go ahead and uh, copy these and then uh, let's just talk about these real quickly also you will notice that some of these items uh, are in in quotes okay for example this one search engine ranking okay and the reason for that is that if somebody is looking for this expression and if you take this out okay essentially what you know what YouTube does is it looks at this really as three three words but by putting the quotes in here you're forcing it to essentially consider this as one uh, one topic okay so that's the idea behind it and notice that I don't really have uh, commas in here I believe uh, for YouTube you just put a space in there now while this is uploading uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, actually switch to the other one but before I do that I'm going to simply pick science and technology for category and for privacy I'm going to go ahead and uh, leave the default which is the public option okay now the next website I'm going to look at is Metacaf, uh, Metacafe I'm not exactly sure how you say that Metacafe or Metacaf but uh, I'm also logged into this account uh, you'll notice if I click on my uh, username it will take me to uh, essentially my profile. Um, the computer is running a little bit slow because I'm trying to upload the video and record at the same time. But uh, anyway, here's my account. Uh, it tells you uh, a little bit about uh, 
how many channel views I've had. Uh, this is, I signed up for this pretty recently, so I don't have a lot of uh, action going on here as compared to YouTube, but nevertheless, I have my videos here and whatnot. And so, uh, same thing in here. Uh, you can come up here and click on Submit, and this should uh, start up the process for uploading your video. Uh, this is going to be a first time where I will be trying to upload videos to three different websites. So uh, we'll see what happens. But let's, uh, this is my website, uh, this is my file location. I'm just trying to uh, speed things. So essentially it's the same concept. You need to browse to your location, which we have. Another thing you can do for uh, Metacafe is that you can also put in your website address, okay? So if you had a video right on your site, you could also do that as well. I'm going to simply click on upload here. And then um, in this one, same thing. You'll notice it's uploading up here. I'm going to go back to Word and copy essentially the same information that I did. and my description which is uh, does include the website so that's definitely a good idea and one thing uh, that's different about the tags and some of these options are pretty standard okay it's you know suitable for everyone what categories you want to put in I can definitely put in science and technology here uh, as it is related to that now as for as for tags um, I believe for this one you have to put commas in there so and I'm going to uh, leave the double quotes in here but you could definitely play around with that also um, to force it to use it as a sentence now here's one thing that's different okay uh, for this site as opposed to YouTube you can pick a language and I'm just going to go ahead and pick English and then US you could also pick a different country maybe you know your video is related to a specific topic and whatnot so let me just uh, click this and I'm going to essentially wait for this to finish while this is going on let me switch to YouTube and uh, you know this has been uploaded so let's go ahead and click Save Changes and it says your video settings have been successfully updated now if I go to my videos uh, it should be showing my video, which is, I think it's still, it still processes it a little bit. I noticed it's not uh, up yet, uh, essentially, but um, once it's done processing, you should be able to see, uh, essentially, you know, a logo here. So the third one I'm going to look at is uh, Yahoo video, which, uh, again, is one of the websites. This one's not as popular, I would say, as the other two, but nevertheless, it's free. Um, and so let's see if we can sign in here. I'm trying to run low, but essentially low on the time, but let me just log in quickly here. And pretty much, you know, the concept is the same, okay? Here again, you're going to use uh, one screen. It will ask you similar information uh, as far as, you know, description, what kind of tags you want to use. So notice, uh, if I do run out of time, I just want to show that uh, it's a similar concept and you click on upload. Um, as far as the comparison between the two, I definitely would say that uh, you know YouTube uh, gets the most uh, activity on my videos between the two. So uh, you know if you are trying to you know 